The Commission of Inquiry set up by the Kaduna State Government investigating the clash between the Nigerian Army and members of the Islamic Movement of Nigeria in Zaria resumes proceedings in Kaduna, the state capital. The group's counsel, Festus Okoye, alleges that the DSS and the police are stopping them from gaining access to Sheikh Ibrahim El Zagzaki. He's also worried about the health conditions of Sheikh Ibrahim El Zagzaki, who's been in detention since December 2015. If we have access to him and he says we don't want to appear here, my movement will not appear here, we will come back and report to the commission that we've met with our client and he says he doesn't want to appear. But it is his constitutional right to have access to his lawyers under the Nigerian law and under every other statute uh, uh, promulgated by the National Assembly. When you, 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 you are accused of having committed a, an offense or when there's an investigation relating to your conduct, you must be granted access to your legal practitioners. Counsel to the Commission, Yusuf Ali S.A.N., asks the Commission to order the Attorney General of Kaduna State and Attorney General of the Federation to ensure that the group have access to their leader. While ruling on the two submissions, Chairman of the Commission, Justice Mohamed Garba, grants the request made by Yusuf Ali. It is hereby directed that you should liaise with the Honorable Attorney General of Kaduna State and the Honorable Attorney General of the Federation for counsel for the like movement to be allowed free access to their client in order to take instructions for their continued participation in the proceedings of this commission. The chairman also adjourned sitting until March the 14th this year to enable members see their leader.